hey this is twisted big d so you just got your cdl if you've been keeping up with my daily videos now you moved on to the tnt phase it's training in teams is what i call it training in teams is what i call it is i think it stands for trainer and trainee but i call it training in teams pretty much you're running a team truck whenever you're sleeping that truck's going to be moving whenever you're driving your trainer's going to be asleep it's coast to coast it's running a lot of miles you're trying to run as many miles as you can the faster you get your 50,000 miles done the faster you get past the tnt phase and get onto your own truck during this phase you should learn how to do make sure that you know how to run your clocks completely and completely understand them you're going to learn how to do the macros completely you're going to learn how to check in the shippers you're going to learn how to check into the receivers you're going to learn all of this stuff during tnt you're pretty much becoming a your own solo driver or maybe you're going on to a team truck a team driver you're going to learn all, everything you need to do to run your own truck whether it's company or lease you'll decide that after tnt so you're gonna learn how to take a 34 hour break because maybe on psd you didn't have to take no 34 hour break on a team truck you should run out of hours at some point and you're gonna have to take a break and you're gonna set a full day in the truck stop it's not much fun luckily if you're in a good area you might be able to walk somewhere do something get back to the truck tnt's a lot of miles you and your trainer you're gonna get kind of crossways every once in a while because you're spending a lot of time on the truck with that person he's you're in his space you feel like he's bossing you around whatever there's a lot of small problems that you'll have to overcome most of the time it's best that y'all take some time home time during tnt because that's like you get away from each other you calm down and you're like okay we're back on the truck we can get along let's finish these miles so i can get to my own truck you're gonna learn everything different tnt trainers have the shifts different what i used to do is a 6 a.m to 6 p.m shift or a 6 p.m to 6 a.m soon as you're as soon as it hits six o'clock you were pulled over in a truck stop and the next person was jumping in the seat and that's how i ran my tnt it worked out good for me so other trainers do it different ways whatever your trainer wants to do is what you're going to do it's his truck his rules so just get it done get your fifty thousand miles done it you, you think it takes a long time it really doesn't take that long if you're averaging five thousand miles a week it takes roughly eight to nine weeks you're gonna take a probably take a week or some time off during it you also got to go home to change over your cdl either if you have a permit from out of state and you got your cdl you're gonna have to go home and get it turned into a cdl and you're gonna get to drive without anyone in this passenger seat nobody telling you what to do so you need to remember how to safely drive the truck and everything if you need anything you can just wake your trainer up he, that's what he's getting paid for so he shouldn't get mad he should just get up help you out with whatever you need help with and then he's gonna have to go back to sleep it's it's rough doing tnt for a trainer i had student i had i've had two students during tnt and one of them i slept the entire night and he never had any problems he was great the other guy he didn't know too much stuff because i took him over from another trainer and that trainer that had him for tnt really didn't show him how to work the qualcomm and i don't know the situation but whenever i got him i had to teach him how to do all the macros and i had to teach him a lot of stuff and he had to wake me up a lot and i I was probably like groggy and not too happy getting woke up, but I had to keep telling myself, hey, look, he needs help and I'm getting paid for this, so I need to get up and help him. But TNT should go by pretty fast and then you should get your own truck. I mean, it's just training in teams. You're just running a team truck. You're doing miles, your trainer's doing miles. It's pretty simple you get a lot of experience you're gonna get fifty thousand miles worth of experience look at it like that and it's gonna teach you all the in and outs of doing 
your day-to-day -day job once you get on your own that's a little bit about TNT if I missed anything put it in the comments I'll answer any questions hit the subscribe button for more videos 